It's going to be a wonderful night ahead. And let's not forget, double points and a championship on the line. Green flag is out, and 500 miles are underway at Fontana. Elio Castroneves immediately moves through the front. They go three wide as they go through turn one. Montoya by a half a car length in the middle of that front three set now. Castroneves at the bottom of the track. Joseph Newgarden up high, but it's Juan Pablo Montoya who takes the lead in the turn number three. Will Power looks like he has a good car on the bottom at the start of this first dip. He has been making progress up through the field early in this race. Simon Pagano, I can only think that he's got a handling issue. And he's, he's thinking, i got to come to pit lane to get this fixed now. A long, costly, and unanticipated first stop. Graham Rahal and Will Power have been side by side the last two laps and wisely on the front stretch on the last pass, Power decided to give him a little bit of room. Battle for the front of the field. Montoya has it, but Hinchcliffe is right there. They come through turn three. Hinchcliffe looking to take over the lead of this race from Montoya. Wow, massive moment for Simon on the warm-up lane. Just saved the car, nearly a spin there on cold tires. Ryan hunter Ray has just taken the lead of the race away from Montoya. Another change. This is the 13th lead change in this race among seven drivers. hunter Ray on the inside middle of the track. Cannot get a pitch him down, Mark. There's another car right there in the middle of all of that. And a front move by Ryan hunter Ray. He slipped around Charlie Kimball that just came off the pit road. Whoa, Ryan car Ray spinning, spins off car spinning. Number four. Ryan Hunter Ray lost control of the race car. He's sliding backwards into the infield across the grass pole. He didn't touch anything, but he was in that battle with Tony Kanaan. And all of a sudden, that car stepped out. Caution comes to Auto Club Speedway for the first time tonight. Tony Kanaan beats Elio Castroneves out of pit lane. Juan Montoya right behind Nick Yeoman. Oh, it's the target duo of Kanaan and Dixon that race off of pit lane. One, two, followed by a pack of Penske cars. Here they come. They pick up speed. The green flag flies, and Tony Kanaan leads the field into turn number one. It's Dixon right behind him, then Castro Nevis, then Power. Castro Nevis and his teammate Power side by side. They are battling for third place, and neither one is giving an inch. They're probably six inches apart. Team orders here right now up front one and two. It's the two targets, but at the bottom of the race, Jack Will Power trying to find out which way he wants to go. Tucks behind Kanan, now down low behind Dixon. Ganassi Penske above the four cars, and they are slugging it out to the bottom of the racetrack. Goes Will Power. Will Power takes the lead at Auto Club Speedway. Battle between Kanan and Power. Kanan moves to the high side. He is trying to pick power off. Kanan pulls away as the leader. It's the last pit stop of the year as Scott Dixon peels out with a good stop for the target crew. They'll pack that horizon car full of fuel. Will Powers down the way for the final time. Elio Castroneves. He has a drive through penalty coming. It's for going back up on the and track. He was hustling around the bottom of the track and slid up out of the out of the groove into the track. And that's you got to keep all four wheels under that. Once you do make that commitment, you're not allowed to come back up onto the racing surface. And Tony Kanan takes the checkered flag. Tony Kanan is the winner. There goes Dixon across the line in second. Carpenter is going to cross the line in third. Will Power crosses in ninth. He leads the points to the finish of the season by 62 points. Will Power is your new Verizon IndyCar champion, his first time in that seat. <laughs>